Science at NASA. Usually, waking up before sunrise is a good way to get a head start on the day. On October 21st, waking up early could stop you in your tracks. Blame Halley's Comet. Every year, in mid to late October, Earth passes through a stream of dusty debris from Comet Halley, and the pre dawn sky lights up with a pretty display of shooting stars. We expect to see about 25 meteors per hour when the shower peaks on Sunday morning, October 21st, says Bill Cook, the head of NASA's Meteoroid Environment Office. With no moon to spoil the show, observing conditions should be ideal. Because these meteors streak out of the constellation Orion, astronomers call them Orionids. The Orionid meteor shower isn't the strongest, but... It is one of the most beautiful showers of the year, notes Cook. The reason is its setting. The shower is framed by some of the brightest stars and planets in the heavens. Constellations such as Taurus, Gemini, and Orion provide a glittering backdrop for the display. But that's not all. This year, Venus and Jupiter have moved into position with Sirius, the dog star, to form a bright triangle in the eastern pre-dawn sky. On the morning of October 21st, blazing pieces of Halley's Comet will cut straight through the heart of this celestial triad. To see the show, Cook suggests going outside one to two hours before sunrise, when the sky is dark and the constellation Orion is high overhead. Lie down on a blanket with a broad view of the heavens. Although Orionids emerge from a small area near the shoulder of Orion, they will spray across the entire sky. Be prepared for speed, he adds. Meteoroids from Halley's Comet strike Earth's atmosphere traveling 148,000 miles per hour. Only the November Leonids are faster. Speed is important because fast meteors have a tendency to explode. Occasionally, Orionid fireballs will leave incandescent streams of debris in their wake that linger for minutes. Such filaments of meteor smoke twisted by upper atmospheric winds into convoluted shapes can be even prettier than the meteors themselves. It really is a wonderful morning to be awake, says Cook. Just don't plan on going anywhere in a hurry. For more news about events in the night sky that can stop you in your tracks, visit science.nasa.gov.